people giving me pressure for pressure. I don't like it. And I don't like people holding me to ransom. Huh? Because you are not in my campaign committee. But my leader, so you, you mean that the only people that, that were in your campaign team, my leader, they are the only ones that you'll be responding to no, and helping? No, no, I'm telling you that uh, those people who campaign who suffer with me, uh, the only people that were with you, my leader. They speak uh -huh. to me, okay? They don't speak to me the way you speak to me, they respect me, mm. and they appreciate me, they know me. Mm. But if I make the move with you, that's why we come back and we come back and we go deeper about you. No, but my leader, because, you don't know me. because my... if you knew me, you can't tell me that I don't answer your call. Because me, for your information, I answer even people who are not who who didn't even campaign for me, who are not even UPSC, who are just citizens of that. Yeah, but I my people who do think, but so don't shout at me, no. My leader, me I'm not me I'm not shouting at you. I'm raising a concern because because me I'm saying the, in the text me I'm saying look uh, there are many times no, that I've tried to, like to call I've tried to call uh, don't talk to me like that uh, you can complain but complain in a manner they only complain to your own parents mm. don't complain to me as if I'm doing something deliberately. I'm trying to disappoint you, I'm trying to hate you, or I don't respect you. No. Don't talk to me like that next time. My leader, as we feel we feel we feel we feel, we feel neglected because he, no. because the way it is, there are many times that we have tried to reach you. And sometimes you, you have you've 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 paid us come we uh, let me tell you uh, because you don't know me, that's why you have the problem. Okay? And you don't even know my problem. That's why you have a problem. Don't ask me that they will tell you what kind of leader I am. Ask your district chairman, he will tell you what type of person I am. So please don't give me unnecessary pressure. I've got enough problems at the moment. Okay? I've got enough people fighting me. So don't add to my problem. Okay? Don't add. You want to speak to me? Just speak to me. Please. Yes, my leader, and my, 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 my reason of actually texting like that is because the alternative, the alternative there is that I've been trying to call, and that is the reason why now I've been forced to text you like that, because I've realized that avenues of communication have proved futile, you know? Don't, don't talk to me like that, yeah. but by uh, so don't that's why talk now, to me as if I'm uh, doing things with or I'm enjoying myself and you yourself. Don't talk to me like that. I've advised you. Mm. Otherwise, that's why you guys are finding yourselves with having problems. Because you don't know how to work with your own ministers. Mm. And you think speaking to me like that is what will help you. No, you my leader, but me, I've not insulted you. I've not insulted in any way. I've just actually brought in the very fact that with the communi communication has not been there in as far as trying to reach you. We wonder why other people, when they call you, you give them attention, you respond to them. But so us, we are having challenges. They, because because yeah. they respect me. Yeah, but it's me, I've not like insulted in any way. I've just said that there has not been communication and we feel neglected. We are, we are, we are on the structures and when we call you, you are our leaders. We must, feel, we must feel supported, my leader. We are human beings. Last time we, uh, we, we, we communicated, you told us to come to your place. We, we went there. We almost waited the whole day. When, I, when you said follow us to the church, we followed you. You started picking up your, your phone calls. We are human beings. We also feel it sometimes. We understand you are busy. But sometimes even just a second or a minute can go a wrong way. And some of these issues that we advance, the Honorable Minister, they are not our personal issues. They are there to help your ministry move forward. Because the, the, the agenda that I've been, I've, been, I've been following you for is not the agenda that benefits me. At the end of the day, it benefits you directly as a minister. We have drivers that are suffering, and these drivers that have been oppressed under your ministry have brought this issue to your attention many times. We have people there who are trying to fight you yourself. We are trying to raise these issues to support your ministry. But it's like our efforts to complement your efforts are... Are not being it, are not being a honorable minister. So I don't you know if you you say that we who are in the structures are your eyes. If we who are your eyes, when we try to to bring such issues of great importance to your minister, I ignored. Then I don't know. 
Last time you let told me, me let that. Let, he, let me let yeah. me tell you. Let me tell you. Ah. Let me tell you. Ah. If you are going to call me ah. and just to become rude to me while you are getting that, I will not appreciate you. But, no, I'm not I'm being rude. I'm just, I'm just actually, I'm just, you know, you know, wondering why you are no, saying I'm, with, I'm insulting you when actually I'm raising a, a valid you, point you, that there has not been communication. Have you read your message? Have you read your message? The message, my, my reader there, it is saying that you, you have, we have, we have tried to engage you, we have tried to meet you, have tried in person, but you are not helping our, our, us, your people. I don't know what the what the, what, the, what insult is there, you, my leader. With case, me saying that you, you don't know, let me tell you. Uh, in case you don't know, uh, I help a lot of people. Uh, if I didn't help you, it doesn't matter that uh, I don't help others. Uh, find uh, out. Uh, find out. Uh, and that's why that's why you come to me because they told you me I help people, but I don't like anybody uh, to talk to me as if I'm always that person. I feel offended and I don't like. It. Hmm. Because me, my leader, I didn't call you to, to beg for money or to my point of calling and the issue you already know about it, that it's actually involving your people in your own ministry. But I'm wondering why uh, I'm being you know, pushed to think that probably maybe I insulted or anything, but meanwhile you know, I'm raising a valid point that is supporting you. This is an issue that we talked about and you said, let's talk about it, let's meet, but from that time, You've not uh, been picking calls, Honorable Minister. So, I don't know. We, we I don't know. It's quite unfortunate that uh, we move in this if, direction. If you can't see my point, then I have a problem with you. If you can't see that your note is rude to me and you think that's the way you're going to talk to me, then I'm afraid for me, that is not the type of people I want to work with. People who don't have respect for elderly people, people who think they can speak anyhow. No, me, I don't like that kind of thing. I like to respect people and I want people to respect me also. You know? But if you can't see that you have made a mistake in statement and you are insisting, then for me, I'm sorry. My dear, me, I'm I, I, I'm one kind of person who respects elders very much. And you, I see you as my parent. I've got a lot of respect for you. In my submission, in my text message, my reader, the points that I'm raising, and I still repeat on that point, if I read my message here, saying, good evening, honorable, a hundred times I've called you and you've not picked the cause. I don't know whether me, Telling so you, you that you have, not, you have not, you have, you have not attended to what that means out. Did you call me hundred times? Many times, my reader. Many times I've called. Many it's times, hundred times. times and see. sometimes we come there at, at your office. We go back to our homes and attended to. And even the issue that I'm talking about, honourable minister, I've brought it to your attention before. You are aware about this issue about the MOH drivers. You, we came to your but place, you, Honorable Minister, and that now, time when you we came me. to your place, you told us, wait for, for us. We waited Listen. nearly the whole day there. When we called you, you didn't pick up. You said, follow us, follow me to, to the church. We followed you there. You, still you didn't up. follow me. Where did you yeah. call to the church? We followed you there. We, we, you stopped picking up, my leader. But that was the yeah. So this is a thing. This is a thing. This is a thing. This is a thing. After change, that's when I will speak to you. Yeah, but you, you, never, you never met us, my leader. We, 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 we got stranded because we are not picking up the phone call. We came back to the place that we waited. You were nowhere to be seen. Anyway, I don't know what happened there. Because me, I told you, follow me to church, and you were not in yeah. church with me. The following day again, church, the following day again, when I missed, I was calling. I called, I called, I texted. Even the, the evidence is there of my, 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 my follow-ups. So if, we, if our leaders are treating us like that, then I don't know what is the purpose of us being on the structures. Because we yes, think that being on the structures, we are there to help you. To help yes, you to govern. Helping, uh. helping me to govern uh. is not talking to me rudely. No, that's not... I'm not being rude. How you help I'm just speaking like this help. because... I'm speaking like this because I want to exhaust this great opportunity that you have 
called me and you have answered because I don't know when next I'm going to talk to you because you don't answer. So if if that is an insult, then I don't know because I'm speaking airing out our grievances, honorable minister. We, you, you are your president, you are a government official, you are a government official who is preparing to QL and man and so forth. As we don't doubt, if you give us an appointment to come and meet you there, we use our QL, we use our talk time to meet you, and the things don't happen. We feel more frustrated because we thought we been in power now with you, our people, you help us, but we have been frustrated. Help you with what, Dash? Did you ask me to help you? That's you why I'm saying that, to... Honorable Minister, me, I never came to ask for money or a job. What I'm I did saying, is that I, I, I brought people in the ministry help to help you. Came you came to help me. Eh. You said you came to help me. Yes, because there are drivers in MOH, I told you to say, the, we have got a case of MOH drivers that have been oppressed. They were oppressed in the time of the PF. They were, they, they are, they are, their job description is drivers, but they are getting paid salaries of of, of general workers. And we have, we, we have we have brought this case to your attention. I told you of uh, one Jonathan Champat, one of the drivers that were fired on an account that they exposed the NB saga, where they were being forced to transport drugs, fake drugs from one hospital to the to another. And these people are suffering up to now. All these issues, Honorable Minister, I brought them to your attention. I brought all these issues to the attention of your ear. And you said, oh, bring these drivers to my house. We came there, we were not attended to. We've been making follow-ups. Nothing has happened. Those people are not related to me. They are not my brothers. I'm not benefiting anything from them. It's out anyway, of the person that your minister... Okay, listen, let's move forward. I think, I think we have talked enough. It is clear we are not going to listen to each other. Mm. You've got your own way of looking at matters. I've also got my own way. So maybe we can leave it at that. No, I thank you so much for listening to me. I can trust you, Honorable Minister, that if I've made any mistake, you forgive me. No, my point didn't is very simple. That, uh, as far as we, are we who are in the structure, oh. Honorable Minister, we as far are. As far as you are concerned, you are not wrong. So since it's not wrong, and that's how you talk to elderly people, that's how when you are frustrated, that's how you talk. I have accepted the way you talk and have said, Ziko Mutasi, like, okay. Thank you so much, Honorable Minister. I still emphasize that let there be communication between you people and us in the structures. That issue for me, I will never talk about it, about the drivers. I've reached it to your attention. That's all.